Surrey Satellite Technology Limited, or SSTL, is a spin off company of the University of Surrey, now majority owned by Airbus Defence and Space, that builds and operates small satellites. Its satellites began as amateur radio satellites known by the UOSAT University of Surrey Satellite name or by an Oscar orbital satellite carrying amateur radio designation. SSTL funds research projects with the university's Surrey Space Center, which does research into satellite and space topics. The university sold a 10% share of SSTL to SpaceX in January 2005. It then agreed to sell its majority share roughly 80% of the capital to Eads Astrium in April 2008. In August 2008 SSTL opened a U.S. subsidiary which it closed in 2017. SSTL was awarded the Queen's Award for Technological Achievement in 1998, and the Queen's Awards for Enterprise in 2005. In 2006 SSTL won the Times Higher Education Supplement Award for Outstanding Contribution to Innovation and Technology. In 2009 SSTL ranked 89 out of the 997 companies that took part in the Sunday Times Top 100 companies to work for. History Surrey Satellite was founded in Guildford, Surrey, UK in 1985. In 2002, SSTL moved into remote sensing services with the launch of the Disaster Monitoring Constellation (DMC) and an associated child company, DMC International Imaging. SSTL also adopted the internet protocol for the DMC satellites it builds and operates, migrating from use of the AX.25 protocol popular in amateur radio. The Clio Cisco router in low Earth orbit, on board the UK DMC satellite along with a network of payloads, takes advantage of this adoption of the Internet Protocol. In 2010 and 2012 SSTL was awarded contracts to supply 22 navigation payloads for Europe's Galileo Space Navigation System and in 2017 was awarded a contract to supply a further 12 payloads. In 2008, Surrey formed a U.S. subsidiary, Surrey Satellite Technology U.S., in Englewood, Colorado to focus on the U.S. smallsat market. In June 2017, SSTL announced they would close the Colorado Satellite Manufacturing Facility in the U.S. and would consolidate all manufacturing back into the U.K. Topic satellites Utilsat quantum satellite platform consisting of a central thrust tube housing a bipropellant chemical propulsion system, geomomentum wheels and gyro, small geostationary platform. Delivered to Airbus in Toulouse January 2019 for assembly and testing. Cosmic 2, FORMOSAT-7 for National Space Organization Taiwan, and NOAA US. Atmospheric limb sounding by GNSS radio occultation, ionospheric research, follow on mission to Cosmic, FORMOSAT 3 Vesta 1, a technology demonstration mission for Honeywell launched December 2018 that will test a new two way VHF data exchange system VDES payload for the Exactive Advanced Maritime Satellite Constellation. NOVASAR-1, part funded by UK government, S band SAR payload supplied by Airbus Defence and Space. S-band synthetic aperture radar to help monitor suspicious shipping activity. Launched on 16 September 2018, by ISRO. Remove debris, active debris removal ADR technology demonstration in 2018 e.g. capture, deorbiting representative of an operational scenario during a low-cost mission using novel key technologies. Remove debris will deploy a representative small satellite and then will recapture and deorbit it. Launched on 2 April 2018 to the International Space Station, deployed from the Kibo airlock on the ISS in June 2018. Telesat LEO prototype satellite for Telesat as part of a test and validation phase for an advanced, global LEO satellite constellation. Launched January 2018 Carbonite 2, an Earth observation technology demonstration mission owned and operated by SSTL and launched January 2018 which successfully demonstrated video from orbit capability Triplosat, a constellation of three Earth observation satellites imaging at 1 meter resolution. Image data lease to Chinese company 21AT. Five Rapidae satellite platforms delivered to MDA McDonald Detweiler and Associates for the Rapidae constellation and successfully launched from Baikonur on 29 August 2008. 
UK DMC-2 and Deimos-1 were launched on a DNEPR rocket from the Baikonur Cosmodrome on 29 July 2009. NIGERIASAT-2 and NX satellites, successfully launched on 17 August 2011. EXACTVIEW-1, successfully launched on of July 2012 on a Soyuz rocket from the Baikonur Cosmodrome. SAFIRE, providing a satellite-based resident space object RSO, observing service that will provide accurate tracking data on deep space orbiting objects. SAFIRE is the Canadian Department of National Defence's first dedicated operational military satellite. Its space-based electro-optical sensor will track man-made space objects in Earth orbits between 6,000 and 40,000 km as part of Canada's continued support of space situational awareness and the U.S. Space Surveillance Network by updating the U.S. satellite catalogue that is used by both NORAD and Canada. Strand 1, Surrey Training, Research and Nanosatellite Development 1, launched in 2013, flies several new technologies for space applications and demonstration including the use of Android operating system open source operating system on a smartphone. See also Aerospace industry in the United Kingdom Comparison of satellite buses UOSAT-1 UOSAT-2 UOSAT-3 UOSAT-4 UOSAT-5 UOSAT-12 UK DMC UK DMC-2 UK DMC-3 Deimos-1 SNAP-1 nanosatellite for Sat Alpha and Bravo.